Hi, Pastor Nathan Decker with your hashtag Better Together Devotion for today. And how we, do we prepare in the Advent season? I've been talking this week about Advent and, and the fact that we're called to be in preparation and expectant waiting. You know, what else are we supposed to be doing? Well, one of the things that we're also supposed to be doing is wandering. Wandering, not like uh, wandering around getting lost, but wandering as in a wonder. W wondering might be the better way for me to pronounce that word. Uh, that we're called to wander within the wonder. We're called to think about all the things that could be. If, if anything, Advent offers us a season in preparation for New Year's resolutions. It, because it gives us this moment where we get to say, what what would it look like if if God truly was here ruling everything and and as joy to the world saying he rules the world with truth and grace what would that look like what would it look like if we started acting and behaving in such a manner that we 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 showed that Christ was our king that we showed that we were not of this world but instead we're just citizens of heaven wandering through this world what would it be like if we wondered if we wondered with a wonder of hope and grace, and we got lost in that wonder, love, and praise, if we got lost within thinking about the, the wonderful ways that Jesus is the expression of love of God among us, of God being with us, of God suffering for us, of God offering salvation through us to one another. Take a moment today and get lost in that wonder. I like to, when I was a kid especially, and I still do, I like to turn all the lights off at night in my house and just sit in the room with the Christmas lights on, on the Christmas tree. When I was younger, I was nearsighted, and the lights would just blend in with one another and create kind of circles of influence of light. Get lost in the wonder about what could be. Think about the wonderful beauty of who Jesus is. Think about the wonderful love that God is showing us. And then go about your day showing that, expressing that, reflecting that light. Take a little Christmas, if you will, in your heart. Everywhere you go, take a little Christ with you. Everywhere you go. And you'll find that we're better together when we prepare for, prepare for Christ this way. Amen.